In the last episode, we rode the Cape course and it was fantastic. It was one of the best rides that we've ever done. It was amazing. But now we are in San Ferran and we're gonna have a little walk through the town. And then later on, we'll show you the route for our day. Again, this place looks like it will be bustling in the summer, but for now, we've got the little town to ourselves. It's really sweet, isn't it? It is. It's nice and on the water as well, with all the yachts and the boats. Yeah. There's a great selection of restaurants here as well. And it's really good. It's like bike parking at the opening of all these cities. Yeah, that's great. Oh, this is a road. <laughs> Trust the Italian car would come down here. <laughs> it's a good size, isn't it? She was taking no prisoners. <laughs> Job, you still don't get her vest on. Yeah. Oh, I love it. Oh, tacos and sushi. Oh, it's not open. Oh, closed. I keep getting that disappointment. We might have to go in search of food a little bit later on. It doesn't look like there's many places open right now for food as it is low season. But in the summer, I'm sure it's bustling with places. But I think we might just grab a drink here and then head back on the road, really. It's a lovely yeah, little stop. It is, isn't it? I don't think we're that far from where we'll be staying tonight. Um, but it looks like a nice ride for this afternoon. Oh, yeah, it's going to be gorgeous. We're going inland a bit now. Um, but we'll show you the exact route on the bike because I'll, I'll get it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But uh, you might even see some pigs in the inland part. Oh, I really hope so. But supposedly everywhere. We haven't seen one yet, but I don't think they like to live too far, too close to the sea. So what's the plan for the day? Right, just looking at the route that we did when we were at home. I'm glad we did that. It makes life a lot easier now we're here. So we are currently in San Florent and we're going to head a little bit further south, hugging that west coast. It looks like a really twisty section of the road. We're going to go inland now. We've just done the coastal road, so a little bit of inland, and then we're going to drop down, and tonight we're going to stay in Lil Rosa. So, yeah, should be a good hour or so ride down. How many kilometres is that going to be then? Around 100, I think? Um, I think about, well, today? Yeah. Yeah, we've only got about 48 left. Oh, wow, that's so, awesome. Yeah, it's not so, so much at all. We've already done 130 today. And as I say, it's been absolutely spectacular and every kilometer was brilliant. So it's looking good. Cheers then. Cheers then. We're just leaving San Florent. We'll have a little bike tour. I think you can ride pretty much through the old town. We can't go down there. I think you have to do a loop. Not really sure which way we're going. The port uh, or the citadel? Go to the port. Yeah. I definitely don't think you can go down there. Oh no, there was a bike <laughs> down there. <laughs> I don't think you should be able to go down there though. Oh, it's pretty tight, isn't it? It's like, cool, isn't it? It's a nice echo in the street though. Behave you. But this is right at the front and here's the port. Okay, we can do the loop round. Gorgeous all of these yeah. little restaurants as well yeah i can imagine the atmosphere in the the peak seasons here is great all right where to next then all right just going to continue our route i think uh, a little bit more on the coast and then we're going to see a little bit of inland corsica for the first time sounds like a plan oh deviation i'm going back to where i started from <laughs> Well, that's good, isn't it? The deviation just ended. <laughs> so I guess we need the Citadel. Okay, going on even more of a tour. Oh, deja vu. All right, let's try again. I feel like we shouldn't be riding through here. There's another lost GS by the looks of it. <laughs> yeah, he's done a couple of laps around here. Oh, it's so sweet. I oh, know. I think these are these, are these turning around as well. Or? Yeah. I think we can go up there. Okay. If this not, we'll gorgeous. be turning around pretty quickly. I think. I think we'll turn around. Am. Um, yeah. You know what? Let's just go the wrong way. <laughs> not that we endorse that at all. <laughs> So that was the city tour. 
the city ride through San Florin and now back to the coast road. Well, the landscape has changed quite dramatically in the last 10 kilometers. It's getting quite rocky. It looks like uh, like a limestone formation. Some of the rocks got like holes in all of the bits. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Really, like like you said, John, just that dead, dense bush and then loads of rocks. Complete contrast to what we were at with the sea. And the road has just been cut into the rock. So it's quite a cool little ride we're doing. Yeah, there's not been one straight road at all. And like around each like different corner you get an unexpected vista of like, changing scenery. I, I don't know, I kind of expected everything to look the same, but so far there's been quite a variation. Yeah. Temperature is still very warm. And so far the roads have been in great condition considering yeah. we're kind of up in the middle of nowhere aren't we at the moment yeah they're not bad at all i actually expected them to be worse from what i read and the uh the new navigator has been doing really well as well i'm quite mm. impressed with it i mean i went from the nav 5 which was about eight to ten years old to this one and it's like having a huge phone in front of you and it's quite good when you load the GPX maps to it, it fades it out the bit that you've already ridden. So, so far it's been really good. Yeah, it's nice. Look at that rock. Oh, high spectacular, isn't it? What a unique landscape. There must be a type of rock that that is. I, I wouldn't know what it is, but... I'm sure there, there'll be a geologist watching. Hopefully. I'm going for I'm going for like limestone or sandstone perhaps. The other thing I've noticed about Corsica so far yeah. is it's got loads of pulling places. That's true, yeah. There's plenty of places to, even if you're in a car I think you've still got the opportunity to stop and take photos. Yeah. And loads of picnic benches which we love. Oh look at the vista around.
great road. This is a, it's a great stretch of road, isn't it? I'm really surprised how clear the road are. I was expecting it to be like gravel and rocks everywhere. But, but it's been I was too. pretty clear, yeah. Really, I was also expecting it to be a lot busier. Yeah, that's true. I guess this is the main route here, is it? Maybe yeah, that's I think used so. more. So we're only, what, 20 kilometres from Il Rosa now? Perfect. Is he setting up a speed trap or is he just doing some maintenance? No, he's just doing some maintenance. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> well, I think that's where we're heading then. We're only what, a few kilometres away now. That's Il Rosa. Looks lovely and really yeah, um, populated comparatively with Cape Force. Yeah, it's got a big uh, another transport ship there. Well, the colour of the water is lovely. It is, even in this um, cloudy weather. Yeah, it's a bit hazy today. I think this must just be the outskirts. Um, and yeah. I think the city centre, we're going to drop down to the water. I, it's a nice place, so far. Yeah, yeah, so far. Uh, turn in right. I actually put the coordinates of the hotel in this one, so it should take us to the door. Ah, oh, yeah, Centreville down here. Nice lady, she waited. It's good. But it's uh, only 300 metres away and it looks like it's oh, in a good location. Yeah, right on the front. Oh, it's the end of this road. It's, oh, it's getting restaurant, cuter so. and cuter, isn't it? It is, isn't it? Oh, oh stunning. According to this, it's just up there. I might have to stop and actually see what the name of the hotel is. Yeah. Little market. This is looking like a really nice little town here. I'm glad we picked here to stay for the night. Hopefully we can find our hotel. <laughs> Somewhere up here apparently, I think. Or is it up there again? Oh no, I think I've taken the wrong exit there. Yeah. Should have gone down there. It's okay, at least you can actually go down this street, not like when we're in Verona. <laughs> yeah. At least you get a little, little tour of the city first. Oh, it's, it's gorgeous. Well, I should probably not be riding on these things. I hear them, like, clinking. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Off on the centre. Um, yeah, I think it's left here. I can't help you now. You wanted the uh, SP oh. Connect. Oh, I've I'm, gone the wrong uh, way again. I'm staying out of it. Oh, I've gone the wrong way again. <laughs> I think the wife nav was way better than Google <laughs> Maps. <aren't they? laughs> Are you sure it's this way? That's the way you've put on on the map you sent me. <laughs> yeah, this one is the little a uh, one that we said is a little bit out of the main town, but it's worth it because it was a great price. Ah, it was, wasn't it? Yeah. I can smell toast. <laughs> What's that? Can you? Can you smell toast? Toast? Yeah, I can smell toast. Oh, actually. that's it. Casa Rossa. Oh, yeah. Nice. Gorgeous hotel parking around the back there. I think so. Hotel Casa Rosa. Ah, and they got bike parking too. Oh, that's awesome, isn't it? Do you want me to hop off? Sure, you can hop off. Um... Yeah. Oh, I love it when they have motorcycle parking. That's great. Yeah, and it's gated as well, which is even better. Enough room for 10 scooters or one GS. I should probably leave a space for someone else. 
Ah, there's loads of room over there. Great, it is quarter to five. It's not night and it's not raining. That makes a change for us. It's it a does. very welcome change. What a fantastic day. Let's go in and get changed and check in and check out this hotel. You're going to love this room. Is it good? It is. It's fantastic. Oh, yeah. yeah. How much did we pay for this one? Then? This one was 60 euro. 60, that's pretty good, isn't it? Yeah, it didn't include breakfast, but it does have a pool. Yeah. Which yeah, is impressive. The pool looks great. It's open till a quarter to ten, the pool. That's late, isn't it? It's quite late, yeah. But uh, breakfast, I think she said, was 12 euros if we want it tomorrow. Oh, perfect. Let's have a look. But yeah, it looks nice. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Got a great bathroom through here. What? Got a shower room. And we also have a little courtyard outside just through that and a toilet. And it's massive, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty big in here. Don't you space? So I'm thinking suits off and a quick shower. Oh, it's got a kettle! We can have a cup of tea. Yes! <laughs> oh, that's my day made. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so what the plan is uh, get settled in here, maybe yeah. freshen up and probably have a little stroll into town. Yeah, yeah, that sounds perfect. I would really like a shower. I feel like I still have boat on me and I also have sea salt on my yeah, skin. I think a lot of, yeah, a lot of salt here, I, wasn't it? I was licking my lips and I think it was like salty everywhere. So shower <laughs> time. So we'll see you guys in a little bit.